they don't allow them to do? They don't have to act as if they did it, if they did anything. So what does that give them, the, sort of the? The guilt. What is, did they kill them? No. Because they say it's not here. They're allowed to be in denial, though, if they did anything bad. Tell me like what's done is done. Right. And so this is something that I think about every single year when I get to the end of this book, okay? And, I, and we've never had a discussion about it in class, so I'm just going to open this up for a couple of minutes. A place that I then go to is, well, what happens when these guys arrive in England and there's no climate and there's no food? I'm like really kind of depressed and maybe really angry and kind of be like a lot different than they used to be and their parents probably won't understand why because they don't really know the full extent of it and I feel like they're not going to fess up about it and then they're going to feel like they can't like they're like kind of carrying the fact that they murdered someone with them and that nobody knows about it and I feel like that's just going to lead to a lot of problems down the road. Like especially when they become like teenagers and adults. Well, I always think that this thing is what I read, so like, I always wonder when I read the story what that naval officer is thinking when he lands on the beach and he sees these guys in his various states of, you know, sporting the clothes and stuff on their face and, you know, some of the boys are dead. And that's really where I get stuck in the end of the book. Like, what is this He's not happy. You do know that a little bit from the story. He, he, what does he even say? Like, these are English schoolboys. Like, he's almost embarrassed for them. He's not that much, right? But I do remember that he's also very really puzzled. Because, again, I think it's what he just said, that he doesn't know the story. But it's like also the fact that, I mean, like just thinking like if you actually had like a seven-year-old son that was going to be in a movie, like the kind of stuff that they did and said, like personally as a parent, I wouldn't let my kid do that. Like I was just wondering what 
And also the fact that they don't have, I was just thinking they don't have accents, but they're English school boys. I just kind of observed that. It's kind of funny. <laughs> Who knows, they're even there in school boys. Yeah, really. <laughs> okay, so let's just go back to this for as we can. All right, and so how are you going back to the crises and all of those wonderful crises that you listed and that you had in your notes? How are some of these uh, re-addressed in the drawing? Yeah. 